Hi guys, welcome to our channel. Today topic is very interesting. If you have created your app and want to monetize it right away by using ads, then you are in the right place. Because we will talk about different types of ads and we will use these ads in the Android app using Android Studio. So let's get started. Let's start with the types of ads. There are mainly five types of ads used in Android apps or games. Number one is banner ad. As defined from the name, banner ads are banner type ads that can include text only, text with an image or any gift animation also. There are different sizes and places to use banner ads. Let's talk about banner ad sizes and their places. So there are four different types of banner ads. Normal banner ad, large banner ad, medium rectangular banner ad, and smart banner ad. Normal banner ad with the size of 320 by 50. This banner ad is used mostly at the bottom of the app screen or sometimes on the top. This ad must be fixed on the screen. Now the second one is large banner ad, which size is 320 by 100. Large banner ads are mostly used in between the app content and can scroll with the content. Number 3 is medium rectangular banner ads. These ads has size of 300 by 250 and this banner is also placed as same as the large banner ads. Number 4 type of banner ad is smart banner and it is the most important banner ad. The smart banner ad can resize with this width of screen that's why it is called smart banner and mostly used in apps. Smart banner is also used at the bottom or top of the screen as the normal ads and it will also be fixed. Also please note that any banner ad should not overlay any content or object in the app. Otherwise Google or any other ad network will not allow ads on your app. Now the second ad type is interstitial ad. Interstitial ads are full screen ads that cover the whole screen of their app. They are typically displayed at natural transition points in the flow of any apps, such as between activities or during the pause between levels in a game. When an app shows an interstitial ad, the user has the choice to either tap on the ad and continue to its destination or close it and return to the app. There are two types of interstitial ads. The interstitial ad can be an image and also can be a video ad. The video ad has more revenue than the image interstitial ad. So this was interstitial ad. Now let's talk about third type of ads which is rewarded ads. As defined from its names, when we use these rewarded ads, the app rewards different features that are not normally available in games or any apps. For example, you are playing the game but unfortunately you are out. So there will be an option that will say click to watch the ad to get back into the game where you were before. Or in some games you can buy coins by watching video ads which are called rewarded ads. These ads are the biggest source of income for game developers. By the way subscribe to this channel will be amazing. The next one is native ads. These ads are mostly used in the apps than the games. The native ad is customizable as the app customization using the same type of views with which you are already building your layout and can be formatted to match the visual design of the user experience in which they live. In simple words, native ads are customizable ad format that matches the look and feel of your app. It appears in line with app content. Native ads are used between app contents and most popular apps are using native ads to match the brand. Now the last one we have is open app ads. Open app ads are the ads format that shows up when the user opens the app or switches back to the app. The open app ads overlay the loading screen to show the ads. That's it for today. As we learn the different types of ads that we can use in our app. In the next videos, we will practically add ads in Android apps using Android Studio. Thank you so much for watching along. If you think the information was helpful, please hit the like button. And if you are new here, don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next one.